if we don't have rain, I mean, it all depends on how severe the drought is, but if we don't have rain, we're probably not going to have disease either. Our crop's going to be a lot smaller. And I mean, there's not a lot you can do if it, you have so little rain. But what we end up with quite often is we have just enough rain to get pretty decent crops. I mean, I want 300 bushel corn. But a lot of times our fields are 200 to 220, and I'm disappointed with that every time. But it's still 200 to 220, and if I take a look at what the crop price is even today, we're going to be okay on our farm. So my point here is if I've got enough to raise 200 or 220, I may still be disappointed, but am I going to have a disease issue there or not? So yeah, we can talk about the plant health side of it, but the plant health side is going to make you some money. The disease side is going to make you a lot more money. I'm just saying it's more important to spray a fungicide for disease than it is plant health. I mean, they're both factors. Don't get me wrong. But if I'm worried about tar spot, gray leaf spot, southern rust, northern corn leaf blight, those tough diseases can really rob a lot of yield.